Oh, if I do tend to ramble, don't be afraid to be like, yo, stop. Like, it's not making sense. <laughs> stop it. Okay. Get some help. All right, what's going on, guys? Johnny here, back with another YouTube video. Today, I'm not alone. I got my buddy Saji here. Hello, how's it going? It's good, it's good. This is my first collab online, so viewers, this might be a bit awkward. I'm just gonna like do a little clap. So today's video, we got a very peculiar video, very out there, very, very, I don't even know what to say. It's just, it left me with a very bad taste in my mouth and it is titled, My Twin Brother is Dead. Saji, just off the bat, what do you think about this? I can honestly say I'm excited, but I'm also nervous. Let's just look at the thumbnail. Oh my God. <laughs> my twin brother is dead. He's got his brother on a tombstone. Now, just off the bat with the thumbnail, this like reminds me of that Ellen DeGeneres, like Kanye rant where he's like, Steve Jobs is dead. You know what I'm talking about? The Kanye? I, I'm actually not familiar. Okay, well then I guess that bit won't work. But anyways, <laughs> Steve Jobs is dead. So Lucas and Marcus are known as the Dobre brothers. Apparently there's five of them. They run a prank channel on YouTube and most of these pranks are fake. I have a piece of paper to arrest him, take him into the station. What did he do exactly? I don't know. It is more of a kids oriented channel as they do have 24.2 million subscribers. So the fact that I came across this video titled My Twin Brother is Dead is not only off-putting on their channel, it's just off-putting in general. Saji, have you heard of the Dobe brothers before? Are you familiar with their type of content? Yeah, I am unfortunately familiar with their content. I don't want to be, but you know, here I am. They do pranks that shouldn't be believable but yet they are to like small children they just kind of make content to like to sort of to exploit children yeah exploit children and clickbait children and it's just very uncomfortable like the what's that guy's name j station like that kind of channel yeah like we went back onto the dark web guys and we discovered that this place is littered with furries it's not to that extreme but it's certainly it's like almost reached that level yeah i mean with this title of this video i think it's pretty damn close to a j station type of video oh yeah for sure all right well so without further ado let's just hop right into the video and watch this abomination play yeah hey so um i got a letter from marcus it says put this on youtube i want everyone to know um, I guess it's a note from Marcus or something. I guess so. <laughs> Can you stop it? Is that supposed to be okay. what I think it is? I don't even want to like say the word, but I guess it's a note that Marcus left after he died. But the way he's reading it, he's just like, it says in this note that Marcus wants me to put this on YouTube. I guess it's a note from Marcus. I guess it's a note from Marcus. Like, yeah, no shit. <laughs> what? It's like he's describing it specifically for the cameraman. It's like, this is a note that Marcus wrote, but it's a note and it's going to go on YouTube and it's a note. And it's from Marcus, if I didn't say that already. <laughs> Marcus, it's from Marcus. Oh, yeah, yeah. Their acting is not good, so it doesn't make this any better than it already is. I don't know what this is. All right, put this on YouTube. I want everyone to know. To my family, I just want to say I love you guys so much and I wanted to write you this letter before I go. I'm going to miss you so much, but now I'm gone forever. Okay, I understand that their audience is like small children, right? That are supposed to maybe believe this kind of stuff, but the way they're portraying it is so unbelievable that I can't even imagine a toddler would believe this. Yeah, my four-year-old dog wouldn't even believe this stuff. It's just like, why out of the blue would your twin brother die, write you a note and be like, yeah, put this on YouTube. He's reading a note off a piece of paper that's literally looked like a child wrote it and he can't even read, so. Yeah, I'm genuinely concerned if anything does happen in their lives that's actually bad, that this is actually how they act. Cause they've had this channel for a while, right? Yeah. I have a feeling that if anything bad were to happen in their lives, this is exactly how they would act and we would have no, no idea. idea. I I'm just so shocked at the fact that they really think that this was a good idea to put on YouTube. I left you something in the backyard to remember me. From Marcus, I will see you in the sky. He's like a fourth grader reading a book in the sky. In, in the sky. The in the sky. Is it a sky. Sky. Oh, sky. Sky. Yeah. Okay. Maybe he's on a plane. Yeah, maybe he's just lying away. Is he here? Hold on. Let me check, him. Let me check if he's in his room. Is this what rich people do in their spare time? They just pretend one of them died. Yes, I get all your money now. When you say that, it means like, I'll see you when you're dead. Really? The cameraman is just like, come on, it means he's dead. Catch on already. It's been two minutes. It's like everyone's in on the video, but he is. So he's like, what, what does this mean? What, what, what's going on? <laughs> I'll up. see you in heaven. Hold on, let me heaven? check if he's in his room. Is this real? Like, what's going on? Why do you leave me that letter? I don't know. Oh my God. He plugs his Instagram. <laughs> my brother is dead. Follow me on Instagram. 
Are you kidding me? Guys, I'm so sad right now. My brother died, but please follow me on Instagram to make me happier. <laughs> this is pathetic. <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I hope he's okay. Yeah, Marcus, you in here? Marcus, you in here? Oh my god. He's not in his room. He's definitely dead. Get the f out of my room! Marcus? Play Minecraft! Marcus? Is he anywhere else in the house? Let's check. Alright. Maybe he's in the backyard or something? Cause like, I gotta tell my family about this. Like, I wanna see if they know about this too. Yeah, I know. Marcus, you in here? Let me call him. Why wasn't that the first option? Yeah, why did he spend a whole two yeah. minutes running what? through the house when he has his number? Yeah, just call him. What? Oh, uh, that, oh, I, I don't understand. I'm sorry, the person you were trying to... Alright, bro, I'm freaking out. Is this just like a giant hide-and-seek game that we're gonna have to sit through? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. It has nothing to do with this thumbnail. It's clickbait for sure. Should I call my mom and dad? Because either Tell these... my brothers? Maybe? Yeah, bro, either these things are not good. Either he man disappearing, like he's gone, and we still gotta go, like... I love the cameraman. He's like, are you f***ing stupid? He's probably dead. He like goes to the most extreme. He's for sure dead. No other options. Definitely 100%. He left you a note. He's not answering his phone. He's not in his room. Deceased. Done, for sure. You meant, you know what I mean. Is it serious like that? Yeah, it is. It is serious like that. I don't, you know know if, I, mean? I don't know if I want to put this on YouTube. Bro, how are you <laughs> going to say that? You can't make a joke in a video about death and then be like, yeah, I don't know if I want to put this on YouTube. I'm not going to put it on YouTube or, you know, plug my Instagram or plug all my socials. I won't do that. Nah, there's no way. Yeah, that is uh, so self-aware, which makes it so much worse. Self-aware and fourth wall breaking. This is very know, meta. The they should be like Christopher Nolan type shit. <laughs> yeah. Very meta. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna wait until my family comes because like I'm, I'm gonna tell them and then he also said there's something in the backyard to my brother's sass and Darius they just got back I'm gonna tell them about the news okay. they're smiling right now but they're not gonna smile <laughs> why would he say that <laughs> they're smiling right now but they're not gonna be after I tell them my brother died <laughs> what what's up guys so, it's a nice little plug of, of the Instagram, Darius Dobrik, because we got to follow yeah, him. Yeah, I know. Got to plug all of them. Do you, do you guys know about this, this uh, note? What? You want to read it? What is it? It's from Marcus. I don't know what it is. Put this on YouTube. Gosh, it's bad handwriting. Yeah, it's a bad handwriting. It's not the fact that he reads at a second grade level. Yeah, what? Put this on YouTube. Want I want everyone to know... To my family, Lucas, mom, dad, Cyrus, Dari. I just want to say I love you guys so much. I'm going to miss you so much, but now I'm gone forever. Sweet. Lucas, please split our money with our family and all our assets. Did he say all our asses? Yeah, I'm pretty sure he said asses. They have so much ass. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're dummy thick. Be like, we, have to, we have to share some of this ass. Bro, we got to share that ass. <laughs> please... Also, Lucas, can you can you keep the YouTube channel? Keep the YouTube channel for yourself? Yo, he's cheese cuz he wants those subscribers. He's like for for yourself? <laughs> I don't get any. It was who died, Marcus or Lucas? Tell with you, Lucas. No, wait. It's actually Yeah, what? I don't remember. <laughs> They're both the same in my eyes. <laughs> They're both irrelevant. I left you something in the backyard to remember remember me. What's in the backyard? I'm intrigued. Um, it's either gonna be him being like, oh, it's a prank, or it's gonna be like another note or something. I don't know. I'll see you, you in, in the sky. In the sky? I don't know what that means. <laughs> Why did he look up like that? In the, in the, in the sky? sky? <laughs> oh my. In the, in the, in the sky? Oh god. Oh. <laughs> no, I, mean, I, didn't, I didn't go in the backyard yet, but he said there's something that is there. What do you mean? He let what? He just left? I don't know. I don't that's know what he's at. I don't know. Did you call him? Yeah, I called him. I looked at his location. I went to his room. There's probably about like six and a half shared brain cells between these three people. Yeah, dude. When they talk to each other, I just like zone out because it's just so dull. There's nothing happening in these conversations. Yeah, I don't know how people watch this like unironically if they're not like children. Yeah, how are you entertained by this? I, I don't I don't understand. It'd be one thing to meet them. I want to meet like the adult people that watch this content unironically. That'll be a conversation yeah. to have with someone. That would be a fun interview. 
No, no, no. I told them this is not like a normal thing. Like, there's like, no good outcome out of this. You guys don't even seem like worried at all. I know, we're all worried. We just don't. We're confused. We don't okay. know what's going on. I mean, it's so funny how it takes some 10 minutes to get to the backyard. The exact time it takes for YouTube to monetize your content. Yeah, isn't that strange? Just just a tad how that's so convenient for them. It almost feels like they're stalling or something. But there's no way. There's no way. No way. No. I don't know uh, if it's I'd a be, prank or not. If my brother left me, I'd be freaking out. Like, I know, I am. Well, let's, let's just check the backyard and see what it is. Because right. then we'll know, you know, it's a clue. So, were we going to the pool? No, we gotta look for something in the backyard. You said in the backyard. Should I leave this here? Yeah. Behind the house. Yeah, that's where the backyard is, behind the house. You don't need to say that. <laughs> what? If I had a shot for every time they said backyard, I'd be dead yesterday. <laughs> it's it's in the backyard, in the backyard, which is in in the backyard, which is behind the house. Yeah. Oh, the backyard. Oh, not the backyard. The, you mean the yard in the, the backyard. Okay. It's the yard in the back of the house. It's it's in the work. So it's a yard that's located at the, at the back of the house. Oh, I thought the backyard was in the front of the house. No, no. See, it's in the back. It's in the back. You know, there's like a door and then you go outside. And then, like, it's not a front door, obviously. It's a back. It's a back door. Oh, it's a back door. The ba the door that leads to the back of the house, which at the back of the house is the backyard. It's the back. back yeah, backyard. backyard. Exactly. But w what if their backyard has a pool? Would it be considered a back pool? You know, now that you mention it, I don't know. I'm clusterfucked right now. How is he just going to leave? Like, what? Whoa. That is not a backyard. That is a forest. Bro. You're going to be looking for hours in that backyard. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, in all seriousness, that's not a backyard. <laughs> that's a ski resort. That is a ski resort, not a backyard. Bro, look in the sky. <laughs> <laughs> look in the sky. <laughs> Wait, is he actually in the sky? <laughs> I don't know. It's like, you see, you see like his face, like the baby son from Teletubbies? <laughs> He just like is the sun. Look in the sky. The <laughs> only thing that's in the sky is the sun, clouds, and planes. Congratulations, you know what's in the sky. Like no, this. Wait, hold on. Look how big that icicle is. Where? Oh. Can I take this down really quick? The icicle. Sure. <laughs> They're getting distracted. <laughs> okay, we have to find our brother. He could be dead. Wait, look, big icicle. Maybe he wants to kick that down to like something. Oh. In there. Oh no. I guess that's not it. That was low-key satisfying, not gonna lie. <laughs> Just so confused right now because this video is like one big joke on a thing that shouldn't be joked about and they're just kicking icicles. Yeah, I don't know what that has to do with what's going on, but uh, I, I'm lost for words, honestly. This is a big backyard. <laughs> backyard, that backyard. Behind this room? Just casually flexing the size of their backyard. Me, I'm tight. Yeah, I forgot we had such a big backyard. Gosh, I have to go find my dead brother now. What? I think it's over here. Wait, what is that? I don't know. Nah, what is this? Are you serious? What is going on right now? If we go under the assumption that it is real, how can someone bury themselves and then put a tombstone on top of their grave? Yeah, exactly. That's just not practical unless he hired somebody, which would be insane. It's not worth our time going in depth on the logistics of how he would do that. So I don't know where in this video there's any value to put towards their subscribers. There's no humor. There's no comedy. It's just messed up. Yeah, it's yeah, it is. Up. All right, now you guys are messing with us. Okay. Like, I swear, I don't know what's going on. All right, well, I can tell you one thing. If someone's buried under there, the the grass is going to feel kind of like smushy and it doesn't really feel smushy at all. No. So. How does he know that information? How many people has he killed to know that? Yeah, what? So let me just step over the grass. See if it's smushy. Oh, it's smushy. Yeah, he's definitely down here for sure. Like, you think he's dead? Nah. No, how can you how can you write a letter if he's dead? I don't know. No, he's, so he's trying know. to say that he died, that he's dead. But what but is that? That could what be a lot of different things. Yeah, it doesn't mean he's literally dead. He could be dead he, for doing YouTube. Maybe he's just done with that. That's no. He maybe. Is, he said keep all the money, right? Well, maybe he like Hasai said. Maybe he's done with like everything. That was their rationale for putting that title. It's like, oh, maybe his YouTube career is dead. So if they get in hot water, that's all they can say. So they can keep this abomination of a video up. Yeah, that is the worst clickbait I think I've ever seen. I, I took this room, like, I don't know if he flew out somewhere, like, to do this, Maybe. or he left, like, I don't know what's going on. But why would he let you keep all the money? 
and everything he owns. That I don't know. No maybe, he, maybe like size. Maybe he's starting a new life. He's moving away somewhere. Like with no money. In all honesty, if that was his reason, like if he actually left, I would think that's valid <laughs> because to like be a part of this family and this YouTube channel feels like like a curse that I wouldn't wish on my worst enemy. Yeah, I do not want to live with anyone in that household in this video, mansion or not, a hard pass. What do you think? I mean, he's saying that was just her friend, his friend. So like, I don't know. Like, I'm just confused. Like, I don't know what's going on. I yeah. just talked to him yesterday. It sucks. Everyone thinks on, everything's a on, prank now. Nah, nah, let's, let's cut the video, bro. Are you shitting me? That's their whole channel. They just literally dissed themselves. Yeah. Do we find out where he is? Or do they just, like, leave it? All right, guys. Stop. I am not dead. I just wanted to prank my family. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. Don't worry. I'm still alive. I love you guys so much. I flew out to LA by myself just to pull off this prank. I can't believe I did it. Are you f serious? That's how they end the video? He's like, I cannot believe I did it. I, I really pulled it off. I, I really got them this time, just like all the other hundreds of times. So that's how this video ends. It's ended, but I don't feel complete, you know? Like, I feel like a piece of me is now missing. I can never get back those 10 minutes of my life. I apologize. I apologize for wasting 10 minutes of your life, yeah, Sag. Yeah, what? What, what the hell, man? <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry. Nah, but like even I'm reading the comments right here as I'm going through, right? I'm so sorry to anybody that's lost someone to suicide. Rightfully so. Honestly, rightfully so. It's it's sad and it's pathetic that these people literally sat in a room and thought, hey, what do we think will make a great YouTube video? Let's pretend that our brother killed himself. Like, are you serious? Yeah, that is some sick joke, honestly. I don't know what was going on through these guys' heads. They have so much money and they have all these brilliant ideas that they thought, hey, what's next? Let's pretend our brother killed himself for views. It's gross that we live in a world where stuff like this gets traction and views because it shouldn't. Like, this shouldn't even be allowed on the platform, in my honest opinion. But that's just what I think. Absolutely. Yeah, this video should not be allowed on YouTube whatsoever. I just, I don't even know what else to say. This is just downright horrendous. It's sick. I'm ashamed. And the fact that they shamelessly plug their Instagram and their social media handles, like it's nothing like they're aware of what they're doing. It's gross. I don't know much about these guys, but what I do know is that they shouldn't be making this content and this shouldn't be long on this platform or any platform whatsoever. It's gross. It's sick. And I'm sorry, I'm kind of sounding on a morbid note, but that's what, that's my opinion of what I think it is. Everything you said is absolutely correct. This video shouldn't be pushed it shouldn't be on youtube whatsoever um and the audience that these guys have are super impressionable and the fact that you're kind of teaching them that you can joke about this stuff is absolutely incorrect if there's a chance that what you put out could possibly hurt someone you know you shouldn't be putting it out of course, if a video of this magnitude, 2.9 million eyes watched this video, I'm not gonna make a percentage of how many people felt affected. All it takes is one person to feel the wrong way towards this to make this video wrong. And that's what clearly is happening as I'm reading these comments. I just don't understand how you can have these comments on your videos and still keep this up, knowing the amount of people that you've hurt or caused pain. You know, it's so despicable. Of course, and it's not like it's like a two-sided debates on whether you know it's a good video or bad. Every single comment is, hey, this is messed up take this down this is serious matter i want to make sure what i put out doesn't hurt other people and if you're not conscious of that as a youtuber it's disgusting yeah exactly exactly all right guys so that concludes this video for today let me know your thoughts on what you think of this video i think it should be taken down that's my personal opinion i'd love to have a discussion on this i really would so this is it for me saggy it was great having you i really appreciate you taking time to react to this video with me of course this was a blast in the sense that i got to make a video with you not that we got to react to this video that shouldn't be on youtube but i did have fun reacting with you yeah man much appreciated that's all for me guys you know saggy if you want to follow him i'll link his youtube channel in the bio you guys can check him out he puts out great content i actually reached out to him for this collab so check out his stuff he's a great youtuber he's he's a funny guy he makes similar content to myself he kills it thank you so much if you want to look at my content go look at his you'll be incomplete if you don't all right that's all i got hope you guys have a great day take it easy and peace bye